I'm, I'm working for a two-state solution, as, uh, also as the Haredi coordinator for Dalkeno, but also in other capacities. I'm a party member of Yerushalmi, which is a municipal party, and also the Labor Party on the national level. I have an organization that I co-manage uh, with a partner named Shmuel Drinman that's called Haredim Shalom, Haredim for Peace. We do all kinds of uh, work, mainly in Jerusalem, with Palestinians and Haredim. We, for example, we bring journalists from the Haredi community to meet with Palestinian activists in East Jerusalem. Um, I also am a board member of an initiative called 0202. 02 is the area code for Jerusalem. And what we do is we have a page that translates news from East Jerusalem for the Israeli public into Hebrew and English. And we also have a page that tra it doesn't translate literally, not, not in the um, phonetic sense, but we translate we bring the Haredi news to the mainstream public through a Facebook page that we run. I'm a feminist activist within my community. There's a Beit Midrash that takes place in my home once a week where Haredi women study Talmud. I also am very active um, in pushing for having Haredi women in political positions. The situation today is that there are zero Haredi women in these positions and it's very important for me that they be incorporated into that. I feel like Jerusalem is on the one hand very very challenging as far as the as far as finding a solution to the conflict but I feel like if we can find a solution that suits Jerusalem as a city and also as a statewide solution then everything else will be a lot easier. Every type of Israeli and non-Israeli is present, represented within the city we have um, obviously my community, the Haredi community, which is about a third. You have um, a third of the city, which is Palestinian, a small part that's Israeli, and a larger part that's Jerusalem residents, but not citizens. And then you have the rest of the city, which includes um, secular, traditional, religious, and every, everything in between. So what I'd like to see is a more, um, more cooperation, more cohesiveness within the city for people to travel past their mental boundaries and physical boundaries in the city, meet other people, and just create solutions through that.